Now, I'm an entrepreneur and uh, met the airline gang uh, early on. The uh, first company I started with the airline was called Blue Tail, which basically was clustering technology on the internet. That was a great success. We uh, sold the company uh, about a year after we founded it for $150 million. Back when I was selling Erlang, I said that one, you could split work over many different computers smoothly. Two, that it didn't really matter if one of the computers broke. Uh, there would be immediate recover, recovery without the customer or the end user noticing that anything actually happened. And three, it's very efficient programming. One person doing Erlang can do the work of 10 to 100 other people. When we released it open source, it was um, sort of a secret weapon. Uh, there was, Ericsson could have kept it themselves and had a secret weapon where they could finish huge distributed software projects and nobody else could. They decided instead to, slept, to, to let it out open source at the same time as internet really took off. And its main good quality of being able to, to split work between many different machines became exactly what was necessary in the industry at that moment. The airline community is growing quickly with the um, use of Elixir instead of just Airline, which is uh, popular among the younger set. So it's wonderful to see the younger ones joining in and learning using Airline, using Elixir, and it feels that the, the generations are rolling and the community is growing, and that's just lots of fun. <laughs>